Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Zeke the Crypto Miner, and today I'm bringing you a video over Robinhood to show you my journey from zero to $100,000 in savings just by investing my pocket change. So here we go. Round it up, round it up. Round up. I thought it would be five, six, two as one dollar. How much? Five, six, two. Five, six, two. Okay. Five, six, two. Round it up. All right, YouTube. If we take a look at my Acorns account right now, I have invested into my future $1,826.08. All right, this account has been open for probably about a year and a month, so around 13 months, and I was able to save $1,826 just from investing my pocket change on my roundups and investing um, $10 every Friday. So if we take a look at my account on my performance details, um, over the last today, the market actually was not good at all. Even my Robinhood hit a pretty big drawback, ran down around like 3% for a very bad day in the market. Uh, my Acorns account is down 1.14% uh, with a loss of $21 today. But still, on the month, just this month alone, from my pocket change being invested into Acorns, I am up $54.07. That's 3.3% in just one month, bringing my account total to $1,826. All time total gains, I'm up 3.58%. But we take a look at my potential. If I stay at this rate, I would reach $100,000 at the age of 62 just by uh, investing my pocket change and, and $10 every weekend. If we take a look at the past, all right, if we take a look at my core right here, my portfolio is set to aggressive. Um, my roundup settings is automatic times two. So every time I spend a dollar and 75 cents, it's gonna round up that quarter times two. So 50 cents is gonna take my change and round it up uh, times two. And you could actually change that to times three and times 10 uh, to the every single dollar. So there's multiple ways that you could grow this account even faster by tweaking your settings a little bit. A little bit. I have my set on automatic. So it's automatically going to do it. I just link my credit cards to these um, account and link my debit card to this account. Every time I swipe it, that change get times two invested into my account. And I have my recurring uh, $10 every Friday. So $40 a month, not bad. It's, it's, it's change I, wouldn't, I really wouldn't see. So I might bump it up in the future to $20 every Friday, but right now I'm comfortable with $10 every Friday because I invest a lot of my spare change into Robinhood. But Acorns has been killing it for me so far, so I might actually do increase it to $20, $25 every single Friday just so that I can see this account, account grow even faster. I don't have to wait until I'm 62 years old to have $100,000 saved into my account. All right. So we back out and go to my portfolio. I have my set to aggressive. Now you could have this set to conservative where it's going to be 20% divided up five ways between pretty conservative um, bonds. If I had it in this, then I probably would have not taken a hard hit today with a minus, what was it, 2% with $21. But then again, I probably, I probably would have not had that gain this month of fifty-four dollars in one month. Uh, the next one up is moderately conservative. Uh, large company stocks, small company stocks, real estate stocks, government bonds divided up. The next one would be moderate, and you guys could take a look at that. And the next one is moderately aggressive, and then of course the one that I take, which is still not so aggressive for me but it's aggressive enough um large company stocks 40 percent small company stocks 20 percent uh emerging uh, market stocks 10 percent real estate 10 and large company stocks 20 percent down at the bottom if you actually want to take a look at what is being invested in you want to swipe over to dollars and it shows exactly i have 729 dollars invested to large company stocks 
$366 invested into small company stocks. Emerging stocks, I have $179 invested. Real estate, $183. I will want more in real estate. And then uh, large company stocks, $366. In the percentage, it shows it right here, 39%, 29, 10, and 20. And then the shares, it shows how many shares I hold of each. And actually, if we was to click on it, uh, this shows it over the day. I have invested into this Vanguard. Let's swipe over. I have Apple, Microsoft, Google, Amazon, um, Berkshire, and JP Morgan. These are my S&P 500 Vanguard uh, investing. So VOO. Let's back out of that. Small company stocks. These are what I have in my small company stocks. Um, I'm not really familiar with too many of these, but uh, it's, it is another Vanguard small company app, ETFBB. So if you guys wanna take a look at that, it's not doing bad at all. In fact, over the last uh, month, I'm up $5 from this small company cap, um, BB. Emerging stocks. Let's take a look at that. Um, Nat Nasper, Alibaba. Oh, that's pretty good one. Um, over the last month, this one has generated me. Uh, I'm up 3.46% in the last month for my Vanguard uh, BWO Emerging Markets. If we was to take a look at the real estate stocks. Let's see how this one's performing. I'm actually curious on what it's investing in. It's ticker symbol VNQ. Um, public storage, not bad, pretty good. Public storage, host hotels and resorts. Okay, Equinox, Equinix. Um, so these are what the real estates, the REITs are there investing into. It's just VNQ. And over the last month, I'm up 2.15% from that stock alone. And then the large company stocks. Let's click that and swipe over. So Nestle, uh, Toyota, Samsung. All right, so this one's pretty good. In the last month, um, up 4.71%. So this one is outperforming all the other ones. Uh, BEA, Vanguard Development Markets, ETF, BEA. So this one is actually doing pretty darn good. So overall, total market gain, $78.99 plus 4.51%, so it's actually killing it. It's doing good, 4.51%, just by investing my pocket change. The app invests everything for me. All I do is spend and invest my change for me. It is stress-free. I don't have to worry about buying, selling. It handles everything for you, and it only charges $1 a month. So another way to make some quick money on Acorns is to actually, let's go back, uh, earn found money. I actually earned six dollars and fifteen cents from found money. If I that every time I use Lyft, I get a uh, point twenty. I get twenty five cents invested into my account. Um, I use Airbnb. I pay for Airbnb um, for a vacation that I went on. I got five dollars and forty cents invested back into my account just by booking it through the application through Acorns application on here. I can order food. I can order Uber. I can order Lyft. Whenever I get gas, I get 25 cents back into my um, Acorns account invested. So uh, Acorns, if you don't have any friends at all and you can't get anybody to sign up using the referral link, at least that you know that when you do use um, Acorns, that a small kickback when you use that app is gonna be reinvested back into your account just by using this account. We look at the past i do get dividends from this um referrals this is not a, a very large referral account i have 20 dollars worth of referrals i signed up my brother my friend and one of my old teammates so three maybe four people signed up using my link so all profits that i have is all profits from uh the app actually investing into the stock market itself is not from referrals like some of the other youtubers Dividends, I am getting dividends from this account. I am getting uh, $18.93 worth of, worth of dividends invested into this account and it automatically reinvested for me back into the account. So, all right, so guys, if you wanna try out Acorn, 
Uh, the link is down in the description. All you do is click that. Once you sign up, you will get a free $5 invested into your account and I will get free $5 invested into my account. So that's something that you don't want to miss. In fact, I think Acorns is running a, um, a, a prize now that if you sign up three people that they'll invest actually $100 into your account. So you guys can get a pretty good boost and a head start on your Acorns account if you sign up now. Um, but other than that, guys, the link is down in the description. I've been using Acorns for around 13 months now, and I actually love it. It's a good app, uh, stress-free, very easy. And you just set it up and forget about it, and I promise that you'll come back and enjoy all your pocket change savings and investments in the future. Might be able to go on a free vacation just from your pocket change. But other than that, once again, leave a thumbs up, a like, uh, subscribe to the channel and comment down in the comment section if you guys are invested into any of these Vanguard or S&P 500 uh, ETFs. But yeah, mm, if you have any questions at all, leave a question down in the comment sections. But other than that, this is Zeke the Crypto Miner, and I'm out. Peace.